Hey guys, today in this video I'm going to be telling you how to make your builds look a lot better. First thing you want to do, always make your door double and even, right there. To make your building, this time in oak, which is what I decided, make a pillar of oak logs going up on each four corners. It'll make the build look a lot better. Then, add an overhang to the build. Boom, boom, boom. And put upside down stairs inside of that overhang to make it look a whole lot better. And I'm going to do that for this side too. While I'm doing this, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. The support you guys give on this videos, on this video and all other videos, is absolutely incredible. You do not understand how much it means to me. Okay. Now, always add, f always change your glass to be glass panes. Look at that, look how much better that looks. It's because of the depth that it creates. It gives it such a better, such a better feel. Boom. Boom. Now, um, I like to use quartz preferably for this, but before we do that, we have quartz slabs and oak slab. Okay, add an underhang to your overhang. This doesn't mean this. This doesn't. This isn't an over an underhang. Well, it kind of is. Wait, let's see. No, that's not an overhang. An underhang. An underhang would kind of be this. This, this is an underhang. I mean, basically. Boom. But I don't necessarily like to do that to my build, so I don't really. I don't even know what number we're on. Wait. Okay, we're on number five. Add a second overhang, which is kind of like an outline of the build. Like, if I were to just quickly fill this in, look at that. And then you see it from up top. It looks great. Um, okay. Next little tip, which is number six. Number six. Always add just just a bit of nature around your house. See, see, just just a bit like that. Boom, 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 boom. I just have to bone meal all of this quickly. Boom.
so just a bit of greenery will always help your build kind of blossom in a weird way but also in a good way I mean look at that forest right there now that was number eight now number nine always add a path to your build and number ten always make that path look all broken up add quarter start and if you're playing in the new Minecraft 1.17 snapshots or updates if you're watching this when the update released rooted dirt you can also add pod stool, but I tend to stay away from pod stool. I just don't really like it. Then, inside of your house, lanterns. Always use lanterns for lighting. Never. Well, not when I say this, I mean never. I mean actually. Never use torches for lighting. If you're early game, you use them. But if you're not and you have access to lanterns, use the lanterns. Put some in your house. On the inside of your house, you want to make that kind of curved roof shape. You don't want to leave it all flat like that. isn't too dark. I mean, it's okay. It's kind of blocky. This is just to add some variation. Oh, also, for the top log stuff, get some wood, and then do that, and then do that, and then do that, and that. I think this is tip number 25. Oh, no, no, 25. I think this is tip 15. Boom. Add a nice frame into your house. Then... Staircase. Don't think you realize this. But sometimes adding a staircase like that into your window adds a whole new layer of depth, especially for the people who don't really get excited. having super big windows. That's all for kind of exterior stuff. Oh, one, one last thing. If you can, either wrap around, wrap your house around in stairs, more the more better looking, or trap doors that are closed. For some reason, I like both of them. Um, like look, look at this. The stair, this action, I like the trapdoor more because the stair just looks like a staircase that's running into your house. I'm not gonna build this all around, but I'm just gonna give you an idea. Oh, on the side of your windows, kind of add some banners so it makes it look like they're those window things the now if you want and you don't do it. yeah you can add windows on to the front of your base but it, it really doesn't matter boom boom look at that already looking 10 million times better 
And we're already, I think, on tip 17. Yeah, tip 17. And we haven't even gotten, and we haven't even gotten to 15 minutes of video. We might do this under 25 minutes. That'll be good. Now, this is kind of for me, but I tend to like to have like a nice rug on your house, in your house. With the new 1.17 update, I almost forgot, level the land with a bit of moss. Moss is the way to go when it comes to leveling. Look how much better that looks. I'm just going to add a few there for the idea, right? The house itself, of course, isn't the most beautiful, so... We're gonna add a tiny window right here. And that window actually works. Boom. Take some pots, fill them with bamboo. All right, I almost forgot. Boom, 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 boom. So you want to kind of make some window sills, and on top of those window sills, put a potted plant with any type of plant that you like to normally put on your windows. That will add a whole new layer of beauty to the build. In between your spruce trapdoors, trapdoors that I like to use, scatter some oak between there. It makes it look like it's all broken up and stuff. No. Boom. And boom. Okay. Always put a bed there. Put a double. What? What? What is what? Okay, there's a glitch in the world. But I. Can't. That was strange. I just couldn't place the chest. Crafting table. Now furnace. You want to get a normal furnace and blast furnace. Furnace, good. Now, blast furnace, smoker, stone cutter. The stone cutter makes your life a whole lot easier. Now, on top of your base here, you can add just a little extra something. Your Shulker box. Oh, shulker boxes. Always face them so they can come out like that. And here, add arches. Arches are king. Quote from Waddles. Check his channel out. We'll put a little, I'll put a card in the screen. I mean, I probably already put a card when I was editing this video, but yeah. Arches, right here. And, I don't know if that's 25, but that should do it. Go back to the starting of the video and look at what this house started like. Look what it is now. It's beautiful. Um, yeah, so, thanks guys so much for watching this. 25 build tips and tricks for your Minecraft base build, and that should do it. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, subscribe, smash that bell to get notified when I upload a new video. Also, that over there, that over there. I haven't talked about it. I built this just as a design myself, but I'm going to show it to you guys right now. This. You want to you wanna know what this is? Something. 
It's the enchanting setup clan building. Oh, oh, that, 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 that. But yeah, look at this. Nice. Go up here. You got the attic. I don't know if we'll be able to get cobwebs, but if we do in our survival series, then we will. Okay, quickly. This is what I used, um, yeah, the leveling of the terrain, so the guy said right over there. But look at this. Invisible item frames. Golden apple tree. And here's a building. Here you have the window ledge, and part, part of it broke. My favorite part is when you go inside. You come inside, and the ladder broke. Someone spilled their ores everywhere, even their diamond there. I come up here, golden apple, and that part isn't finished. But we're just gonna leave that there. So yeah, we if you guys are if we get so the like goal for this video is ten likes. If we uh, if we can get ten likes on this video, I'm gonna make a whole entire 25 build tips and tricks using the invisible item frames. Sadly, I don't know. I mean, I'm recording this at 20. I'm recording this at 4 4:20 in the afternoon, Eastern Time Zone. So I don't really know. But if the snapshot came out, but as of now, it did not come out. Sad. I would have uploaded this video tomorrow. Snapshot today? No. Sadly, well, thanks guys much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And.